This natural habitat shows a lot of the characteristics of honeysuckle. Honeysuckle can grow in shade, as is evident in here. You can see it's a heavy shaded area. And it also, as you can see, it's growing up against this tree here. And what's unusual about that is this tree is a black walnut. And a lot of people have trouble finding things to grow in shade and under black walnut. And here is an example of a honeysuckle. And it's actually competing with Virginia creeper. So it's a vine that can grow up on a post or a lamp post or a trellis and it can find a lot of utility in your landscape, especially if you have hard to plant locations like dense shade or, and as you can see in here, deer, because the honeysuckle has survived deer. This is a very heavily populated deer area. As you can see, the trees have uh, lost all their lower branches because the deer have you know, have established their browse line but uh, the, the honeysuckle can take over and it can be somewhat inv invasive so you do have to watch that but it can grow in these difficult locations for you if you have any questions about planting in shade or in areas where you're having difficulties give us a call at Highland Hill Farm we're at 215-651-8329 and we also have many cultivars of honeysuckle, so it's just not a yellow and white flower. We have other colors as well. And here it is under a walnut tree. This is the peaches and cream honeysuckle. It is a smaller cultivar of the huge wild one that grows in this area. The flower head you can see is this nice pink flower opening buds. And the buds will then open to a pretty white cream color and the yellow stamens. Easily to, to grow grown in this area. Flowers almost all summer. If you can do some deadheading on it, the flowers will continue well into the fall. Party in this area, easy to grow, deer resistant, and a beautiful color.